mostly Teslas. Um, we started off, when the company first started, it was working on Tesla Roadsters. Um, the reason the Tesla Roadster was the chosen vehicle was uh, the owner, uh, Pete Gruber, he used to own a 2011 Tesla Roadster. Um, this was his daily driver, he drove it all the time. Um, one day, one of the field engineers from the uh, Gruber Power Companies that you know mostly works on UPSs, they, um, they came up to his car and they asked him about it. They were intrigued by the, uh, the Tesla Roadster and he started to describe what he understood about the vehicle. And from what he understood, obviously it was a battery, it was an inverter, and you have the load, which was a motor. And then the uh, engineer thought for a second and said, you know, this is exactly the same kind of equipment we work on daily with uh, UPSs, battery cabinets, transfer switches, all that sort of equipment. And that's where the, uh, the seed for the idea sort of came from. Uh, from there, they decided, well, let's, let's see if there's anyone else in the community that's interested in doing this. Um, they found and hired a, uh, a new depot manager who was also interested in electric vehicles, owned a Tesla Roadster himself. Um, and so from there, they, they bought their first Roadster. They uh, pulled it apart, took out the battery, reverse engineered the PEM. And uh, we realized from then on that this is exactly what um, the company Guru Powers has been doing for some time now. They've been working on uh, UPSs and the modules within the UPSs. It's just an inverter. It's the very same thing that you find in the uh, PEM of a Roadster. The PEM is the power electronics module. It's more or less the brains of the uh, powertrain system for the Roadster. And once you open one of those, it's the exact uh, technology. I mean, of course, they have their own different layout, but it really and fundamentally is the same exact in every way. So. From there, um, the company began to repair these PEMs because from the knowledge that Gruber Power had in repairing um, UPS modules, we knew that capacitors, um, other electromechanical wear components such as relays, such as capacitors, these sorts of things, um, they age. Relays from use, from opening and closing and opening and closing, the uh, capacitors, they just have a life, uh, shelf life um, also from being used so um, in knowing that these sorts of components would go out, we predicted that failures were due to occur. Sure enough, one did occur. Uh, the individual contacted us and um, we told them that uh, we can repair this stuff. So we brought it in, figured out it's exactly the kind of thing that we can do. And sure enough, we got the uh, power electronics module running again and uh, sent it back to this customer. Uh, from there, we outlined the services that we could provide. We could either repair it after a um, what we call an event would occur, usually uh, explosive, um, in that the there's several boards with uh, what's called an IGBT. It's an insulated um, bipolar gate transistor. And um, these things blow quite spectacularly at times. Uh, sometimes one may pop. Other times you have five popping and it creates quite a bit of smoke and um, destruction to the heat sink. So most of the customers, they don't think about um, what could happen. They're just waiting for something to happen and then when it does occur, we have to go in, we will repair it for them or um, they try to do the repairs themselves. Um, so we've got a, a service in which we provide a preventative maintenance in that um, knowing that the caps and the other uh, wear components, electromechanical wear components, are going to wear, we give them an opportunity to replace these components before it becomes a problem, becomes an even larger repair bill. That was um, where we started, and from there uh, we started looking into the battery and basically moving into other components and subsystems within the Roadster. It's the vehicle that we've worked on the longest, we have the most experience with. Um, we're quite competent in working on every subsystem within the, uh, the roadster at this point.